Hello. Hi, let me first take you to where I was born. Forget us, it's Spain. Thank you, Dali. You've probably seen his work in the mass media, but how did Dali become so iconic? Let's delve into his life. Salvador Dali was born on May 11, That's 1904, me. to a loving family. He was one of the most renowned and influential artists of the 20th century. He is best known for his surrealistic paintings, which combine vivid and dreamlike imagery with meticulous attention to detail. Dali's work spanned various mediums, including painting, illustration, film, and advertising. He showed artistic talent from an early age and began his formal education at the Royal Academy of Fine Arts in Madrid. During his time there, he experimented with different styles, including Impressionism and Cubism. In the 1920s, Dali Bonjour. moved to Paris, where he became associated with the Surrealistic movement, which sought to explore the unconscious mind and the realm of dreams. Dali's distinctive style emerged during this period, characterized by strange and often bizarre imagery, just a position of unrelated objects and meticulous renderings. His paintings often featured melting clocks. What kind of place is this? In the 1930s, Dali gained international recognition for his artwork. He participated in numerous exhibitions. Dali's eccentric personality and flamboyant public appearances further contributed to his fame. So was Salvador Dali crazy? What? Some people might describe him as irrational or unconventional, but using the term crazy is subjective. He was known for his distinctive mustache, elaborate outfits, and theatrical behavior. In the 1940s and 50s, he experimented with new techniques and styles, incorporating religious themes and scientific concepts into his work. In the latter part of his career, Dali focused on large-scale projects, including the Dali Museum in his hometown of Figueta, Spain. This museum became a showcase for his work, allowing visitors to immerse themselves in his surrealistic world. Salvador Dali passed away on January 23, 1989 in Figueres, Spain, leaving behind a rich artistic legacy. His contributions to the surrealistic movement and his innovative approach to art continues to inspire and captivate audiences around the world. If you'd like to watch more of Al's videos, you can click on the left. If you'd like to subscribe to his channel, you can click on the right.